The Hong Kong Open is one of the great championships in world golf. It has a habit of producing dramatic finishes, and this year was no exception. The top Hong Kong player was Matthew Chung, who birdied the 10th on his way to a 67, and he would finish at 8 under par. Andy Ogletree is the overall international series winner. This a birdie at the 17th from the American, a 69, and he finishes at 12 under on his way to lifting the title. The low round of the day came from one of the youngest players, the richly talented young Korean Yubin Jang. He's only just turned pro. This into the 10th for a 63. He finished in the top five. Richard T. Lee of Canada had a 64 today. This was a birdie at the 12th. And he would tie for third place. Alongside him, Pachara Kongwat Mai, who was right up there at the top of the leaderboard for most of the day. Lovely approach into 13. He wasn't able to convert the eagle chance. And in the end, a double bogey at 16 cost him dearly. Kongwat Mai tied for third. Cam Smith came here as the big favourite this week and he justified that position. This a birdie at the 11th, but he didn't manage a birdie in any of the last seven holes, so I had to settle for second, one behind our winner. Ben Campbell from New Zealand wins for the first time on the Asian Tour, and it's been good to see. He's had all sorts of injury problems over the last few years. Started well with birdies at the third and that one at the fourth. And then into the closing two holes. Lovely approach into 17. He would hold that for birdie. And then add another at the last. The final three ball all tied for the lead going down the 72nd hole. What a finish. What a putt from Ben Campbell. A 66. 19 under par. And the Hong Kong Open Trophy will go back to New Zealand. Congratulations to Ben Campbell, our Hong Kong Open champion.